It was an NRG oncology study looking at platinum resistant ovarian cancer patients and using a combination of doxorubicin with um, actually an EGEN or GEN001 compound, which is a human IL-12 along with a DNA platform in order to introduce this intraperitoneally. Um, so we used this combination and had a dose escalation model and actually we had three dose models and we had 16 patients and we found that we had almost an 86% um, clinical benefit benefit in our highest dose level, so which was pretty exciting considering that this patient population we really don't have very good treatments for. So it's really encouraging and we didn't even reach our maximum tolerated dose. So we're really excited to use this in um, future studies. Dose level three was the most effective. The other ones were also effective as well. Um, but the encouraging thing with dose level three was the fact that we saw the highest um, level of stabilization of disease, as well as we found uh, two patients having partial responses in their disease. And so we found that to be very encouraging because this patient population has been heavily pretreated and don't necessarily have lots of options. So uh, this is very encouraging, um, putting standard chemotherapy along with actually immunotherapy of IL-12 and actually giving it into the intraperitoneal cavity, which is a novel way to always administer drugs for ovarian cancer patients.